Hey, how's it going everybody? Sarasota Tim. Morning chat continues with part three. I'm getting so good uh, within a few seconds of the uh, timer stopping uh, to end the video. I just happened to notice my counter on the screen there and um, I just jumped ahead of it so I can get my crush it in there. And everybody, uh, let's continue making the breakfast, uh, the eggs. The bacon stopped. I smell the bacon. Can you smell the bacon? Well, let's get it out and let's see how five minutes did with the Walmart bacon. You ready? We haven't made coffee yet. It's done. Let's get this out. Out and about. It's very hot. That's the only thing about these. They're very dangerous. Hot. Oh my goodness. Folks, I love the Walmart bacon. Wait till you see this. Yeah, I almost hit my head again on that thing. Watch this. Are you ready? You're going to see it for the first time. Oh my goodness. The Walmart bacon and the Baconator go hand in hand. Our blue light is still on on our um, rapid. Oh, wait a minute. Let's push the button. Hang on, let me just do that. Stop the music. I should have left the lid on so I could press down. There we go. Now let me get you in here. I know you don't want to. You don't. You don't want to mess it. You don't want to mess it. Let's see how it came out. You with me? All right. Now how do we pick that up <laughs> and not? burn ourselves. Look at that bacon, huh? Look at this bacon. Oh my gosh, that is perfect Walmart bacon. Four dollars and change. It had good meat look to it. Look at that. Five minutes, that came out, I mean, every inch, perfect. I really love it. Now, let's see if I can just do this. Oh yeah. Nope, it's not done. We need a little longer, so we put a little more water in. Oh, uh, we're going to go with that much. We pour it in. It's already plugged in. Let's put the lid back on. So we're just trial and error here, folks. I didn't put very much water in at all. The, the measurement said, you know, put so much. Oh, what's that about? Uh, because it um, is still hot and doesn't want to to do it. Uh huh. Oh, maybe I got to unplug to reset it. Let's try that. Plugged it back in. No, the temperature is. Hmm. What's going on? There's water in there now. It's actually not hot. And there's water in there. Cook, baby, cook. I'm, I'm sorry, was I in the way? Why is it, look, this doesn't even get hot. And the, uh, it, it has to wait till it cools down some? What's the deal? There we go. All right. Now, we'll, we'll, uh, I gotta try this bacon. We'll, we'll check on it in a minute. It had just a little bit of the bottom of the egg. It wasn't done yet. Mmm. Mmm. Definitely good. Mm-hmm. Mmm. My head still hurts. Lit up. Half a cup. I gotta give you some of those paper cups um, for the coffee. Ah, that's good coffee, man. That whip, heavy whipping cream. It really makes it. When I go over to um, my good friends, Fred and Raffaella, 
she makes that Maxwell House, which I love as well, and McDonald's. But right now, I'm drinking the gold, the Highlander Grog. I got to tell you, that's the best cup of coffee I ever drink in my life. Mmm. So good, I got to slurp it. People say, why do you slurp it? That's how I do it. I do me, you do you. How about that? Mmm. Man, is that going to be good with this bacon and cheese omelet. Let's give it a couple more minutes. And uh, let me uh, straighten the camera up here. We'll talk a little bit more. You guys like these, these three... Three clips. Oh, I forgot to upload the other one. You could have been watching it. Now it's 7.42. You know, the people in the West Coast, they don't have a problem. They get up. It's already noon here. 11. And they see morning chat. Look, I can't, I can't stop eating it. Who doesn't love bacon? Hmm. So look, other than my Baconator, now what's going on with that? Why is that going off? Why is that going off? It better be done. What's happening? All right, I hear you. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Hold lid down. Push button. Well, let's see if the water was actually gone and uh, the egg is cooked now. Definitely warm in there. Definitely warm. Put this over here. And... Do we have a bingo, Johnny? Is it hot? The steam from there coming up is a little hot. Give it a little blow. Hey, look, you can eat right out of that. Let's see. Are you done? Ha ha ha! Check this out, folks. Can you see it? Watch this. Oh my goodness, that's better than an Egg McMuffin at McDonald's, baby. Oh, let's get, let's, let's doctor it up. Let's doctor it up. Um, where's that pink salt and pepper? Here we go. I forgot about this pepper. Let's see here, a little pepper on it. I like a lot of pepper. I wish I could have tomatoes. I like uh, tomatoes. All right, there's some, there's some salt. Sound like I was grinding some metal. Metal. All right, here we go. You ready? Now this isn't. Let me let me do this. This isn't. You know, I don't know what kind of eggs they use at McDonald's. If they're from chickens or if it's just some. Um, <clears throat> manufactured eggs? I don't know. First, I gotta have another sip of this coffee. It's the best coffee I ever drank in my life, for sure. All right, so here we go. A little bite of the egg. Fluffy. Look how fluffy. I'm not going to lie to you. I can't lie to you. That is the best egg I've ever eaten in my life. That thing cooks it like that with that steam and that butter we put in there. Look at the thickness. Look, look at that. With that sharp cheddar cheese. Mmm. Who 
doesn't like that's really good bacon. I definitely promote that Walmart bacon. That's the best bacon I've ever ate in my life. That is a breakfast right there. This is the best breakfast I've ever eaten in my life. Look. Look at that. I, look how round it is. And all I had to do was add a little more water another minute. And look at the look how thick and fluffy with that uh, th uh, heavy whipping cream. I just put a dash in there. I'm not kidding you because normally when you see an egg shaped like that, like from McDonald's or something, and you eat it, you're like, well, you know, I can eat it. But this may not be from a chicken. <laughs> These are real eggs. This is the real deal. With the bad to the bone rapid egg cooker makes omelets, two egg omelet, no stove, no fire, no grease, no pots and pans. That little bitty thing right there, that little bitty thing of water right there. And then of course, shout out to the Baconator right here. The, the bacon cooker, a minute and a half per slice, four slices, uh, well, no, it ain't a minute and a half, it's five minutes for four slices. And this cheese, I bought the Kraft, I didn't buy that Walmart cheese, I don't buy it anymore. I mean, you've got cheese, eggs, this is the carnivore diet, with your coffee, That is a good egg with that salt and pepper on there and that cheese. Oh my gosh. I'll never buy Oscar Mayer again. This is the best bacon I've ever ate in my life. I have good bacon. Made on the Baconator. Folks, I won't be rude and keep eating in front of you making you hungry. You got to get you, use my link in the description box. I think that thing's only like $18. And um, if you have a small microwave, if you're an RV, you have to do like me and get the round one. I think this is 11 inch diameter. And, um, or the square one would be fine if you got a bigger microwave and you're uh, cooking at home. Uh, but that is a way to cook bacon. It does not taste, you gotta get this rib thing where the oil you know, goes down below the bacon. Putting it on paper plates with a bunch of paper towels to suck it up doesn't work. Comes out dry, awful, and um, bacon sticks to the paper towels. Uh, Miss Raffaella, she saw me doing that, and she said, oh, when I saw that, I had to buy him this. This is the only way to go. It's different. This uh, little omelet tray... Wait, tomorrow we might cook the uh, poached eggs, but we just break them. We don't whisk them, see? We got two poached eggs with the, uh, with the runny yolk. Now, the reason I didn't do it today is because the poached egg, to me, without a piece of toast to dip it in, and I don't eat bread. I'm on the no food diet, the carnivore diet. Meat, baby, meat. That's all I get. Man, am I feeling good today. I'm excited about golf. I'm excited about life. I'm excited about you guys. I'm excited about this wonderful uh, camper that I'm so blessed to own. And everywhere I go. And I might be going. Because I'm getting some new energy. That is some good coffee. So um, this one's going to end in about a minute. I got a couple of seconds. But I'm going to finish my breakfast. And I'll make some more videos later. We'll do try to do evening chat. I did it last night, but it didn't upload. It was stupid to upload it this morning. It still wouldn't upload anyway. Maybe part of my clips were on cinematic or something where it just, or, um, or T-Mobile's playing games. I don't know, but just as well. Um, I'm also going to be reading, uh, I did it the other day. I didn't upload it from the Bible, uh, Deuteronomy 28. 
it is a very good thing to hear. Uh, it's a little like the Crushing It for Christ, but we're going to be reading from the Holy Bible. And it's just a, a, a chapter. I won't even read the whole thing. It's long, but not really that long. But I don't want to, you know, go on and on because the second half of it just keeps kind of repeating itself. And that part's not good. The first half is very good. Uh, if you want to go ahead and, and take a look at that if, in your Bible, I read uh, Deuteronomy 28. Someone sent me a small piece of it, uh, and then I, I got curious about that. So I pulled out my Bible and started reading it, and I said, oh, well, the people need to know the whole context of what, you know. So that time the timer got me, it did in the video. This is the way I'll be doing it from now on. Hopefully these will get up. I'll add this clip to that last, uh, what you just saw. It just blends right in. You don't even know that. But uh, thank you so much, everybody. Please consider subscribing to the channel. Please consider hitting the thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. Uh, all my videos are viral. They're all going worldwide. We've got 177,613 beautiful souls now. And so thank you very much for all that you do. And let's all get out there and crush it.